Hello guys, welcome back to another video, and today we we are going to be looking at some new leaks, um, for some, uh, Star Wars sets. I don't exactly remember when they're coming out, but they will be coming out soon, um, later this year, and, uh, at first I thought it was an April, April Fool's joke, but, uh, I don't think it is. So, um, if you know who Promo Bricks is, um, Promo Bricks is usually the one who gets all the leaked information about Lego Star Wars or any Lego stuff. And, um, Promo Bricks has a whole list of, um, uh, Lego Star Wars sets that should be coming out later this year. And I will, uh, I will put it on screen right now. Um, uh, like, there's a Republic gunship. Finally. Um, yeah, there's, it's, I thought it was an April Fool's joke. And there should be a UCS, um, Venator. There should be, um, two new Ahsoka sets. I think, um, one is the Ghost. And the other is, I think, the T6 uh, Jedi Shuttle. Um, not completely sure on that. Uh, but, yeah, just look at, the, look at the list right there. Um, it will have all the information. And the only thing I'm confused on... Well, I was confused on this at first. The character selection uh, for the gunship... And it's also, it's said to be a, like, Coruscant Guard gunship. So it's not like a, in a, it's not like the normal one. So, might not be the best for army building. Um, but, uh, yeah. My new Yoda glasses. Not Yoda. My new Grogu glasses are cool. They're not new, actually. Um, uh, anyways... But, uh, yeah, uh, sorry for the camera quality, by the way, it's not, it's, it's not very good. It's also, it's late, it's not even daytime, um, so that could also be another reason why, because I don't have the windows open, because there would be no light coming in, because it's nighttime, but, uh, yeah, Anyways, um, yeah, so, uh, on to the conversation. The character selection for the, um, for the gunship is kind of weird. We've got an, um, Emperor Palpatine, well, not Emperor, Chancellor Palpatine, uh, a Clone Wars Padme, which last time we saw her, be, be nice, be nice, um, if you know, you know. She came in the Malevolence set. And then, now this, I actually will take a um, Phase 2 Commander Fox and two uh, Coruscant Shock Troopers. Now, my whole thing with the um, uh, the Chancellor Palpatine and uh, Clone Wars Padme, at first we had no idea... Uh, why that character selection was necessary, but apparently it should be based on the Scipio arc from the Clone Wars. If you're a Star Wars fan, you watched the Clone Wars like I did, you should know what that is. If not, you don't know what it is. <laughs> um, but yeah, so apparently it's based on the Scipio arc. Which makes the character selection, I guess, a little bit more reasonable. I don't know. Also, if it was a Scipio arc, it wouldn't have Commander Fox. It would have Commander Thorn. But uh, I have a uh, Clone, Clone Army Customs uh, face to Commander Thorn um, in my minifigure display case. Right there. Um, so I don't need to worry about that. 
But, uh, yeah, that doesn't really make a whole lot of sense, but, um, we get two Coruscant Shock Troopers plus Phase 2 Commander Fox, and we get a gunship, so, what, uh, else could we ask for there? Um, so, uh, yeah, should be a very, uh, good set, and also with the two new Ahsoka sets, um, the two new Ahsoka sets, um, like I said, one was a T, uh, T6, uh, Jedi Shuttle, um, which I'm very excited about. I don't think they've made one since the, the, since the Clone Wars sets were being made, which were long, long before I was born, so, uh, I'm really happy to actually have one now. Um, but, uh, yeah, so, we should be getting that, um, also, uh, the ghost, like I said, all, also, we, we're getting a ghost, cause, in the new Ahsoka show, of course, all the Rebels characters should be appearing, um, and, uh, like we saw in the Mandalorian, we saw Zeb in live action, hopefully, Hopefully, we'll get to see him in Ahsoka in live action, because that would be cool. But that's besides the point. The thing with the Ghost is, if you're a true LEGO Star Wars fan, you know that it goes for a crap ton of money on eBay. Um, way more than, way more than it, than it probably, we would, probably would have thought it would for a ship that... I mean, I, the ship's pretty, pretty iconic, memorable, but I just started watching Rebels, so I don't know much about it, um, but apparently, I don't know very much about this, but apparently it's not gonna have the crew, I think it's only gonna have Hera, Chopper, and then someone in Hera's son, apparently, I haven't watched the entirety of the Rebels show, so I have no idea what, uh, episode, or what this is even based off of, but, uh, yeah, so at least we get Hera and Chopper, you know, they're pretty iconic, like, no Ezra, or Kanan, or Zeb, or Sabine, or, yeah, those are all the crew members, um, uh, we also are getting the UCS Venator, um, like I said, I thought this was a complete joke, but now I'm starting to believe it. Um, uh, and for the, for the UCS Venator, it's probably exactly what we all think it is. Um, we don't know much about it. Uh, um, yeah, we, we don't, we don't, we don't know much about it. But what we do know is that it's going to come with a young uh, Admiral Ularan from the Clone Wars um, and a Captain Rex. But apparently he's going to have a little area where his inhibitor chip was removed, which is cool. Nice little exclusive print. I hope it's exclusive. Um not like I'm getting this set, depending on the price, um, but, uh, yeah, and also what, what I was going back to saying, I was talking about, um, why I'm starting to actually believe that this is true, and that is because of the, the, uh, Phase 2 Commander Fox, like, helmet and torso leaks, because, I don't remember, I don't remember who leaked it, but someone leaked it, I'll show the picture right now, um, it's, uh, Commander Thorn. I mean, Commander Fox's head and torso, and it, it looks a lot like the one that we saw in the, um, can't remember the name, but, um, it's one, the one where we saw the, all, all, uh, the clone, uh, all the clones we saw Gree, Rex, Wolf, um, Cody, and then we saw, uh, of course, Fox. Um, don't remember what that was from. I 
feel kind of stupid right now. But, uh, yeah, so, um, hopefully these are all true. I'm, I'm kind of 50-50. I think I believe they're true, and Lego is actually finding, finally starting to listen to us. Um, because <laughs> they, I don't, they haven't made a, a true gunship, like a place scale one, since 2013, and, uh, and, uh, um, apparently the UCS gunship, um, was from the original trilogy. I don't really know what they're talking about there, but, um, yeah, so, that is, that is about it. There also is a new, um, uh, UCS X-Wing, it's, I think, the third one, <laughs> um, it does have a cool Luke Skywalker mold, but, uh, yeah, also the, uh, to new Jedi Temple from Young Jedi Adventures, I already made a video covering that, go check it out, but, uh, yeah, that's about all I have to say, and, uh, I will see you in, um, the next video, I guess. I might do a video tomorrow. Um, but, uh, yeah. May the force be with you. And all that stuff.